Well, these days, you don't have to have your children delivered at a hospital. Some women choose to have their babies in a birthing center, while others deliver at home, which is what one Winnipeg couple did this past Valentine's Day. But it wasn't exactly part of their plan. As CTV's John Hendricks shows you tonight, the premature baby surprised everyone with its early arrival. Every parent has a story to tell about how their child was born. Joanne Fontaine and Flynn Dorian's story is one they'll never forget. It happened really fast. And it all happened at home, in the washroom while mom was sitting on the toilet. I was kind of shocked. I didn't know what to do. They should have had more time to figure that out. The baby wasn't supposed to arrive for another month and a half. Joanne Fontaine says she thought she simply had to go to the washroom. But as she sat down, her water broke. I told my boyfriend, call the ambulance. I'm ready to, I can feel the baby's head. The ambulance didn't make it in time. Five minutes later, the baby boy came into this world, falling into the toilet. I had to pick him out like this kind of, and then I, had, I was down on my knees. <clears throat> And I had to hold him. Dorian cleaned off his new son, and a short time later, the emergency crews arrived and took over. The baby boy, named Christopher, was small, obviously, but healthy. Feel good. I'm in love with him. And she has quite the story to tell him when he's old enough to understand. John Hendricks, CTV News, Winnipeg. The couple hopes to take baby Christopher home when he gets closer to his original due date in March. None of the emergency personnel who helped the couple were available to speak with us on camera today. But in a statement, Chief John Lane says the Winnipeg Fire Paramedic Service is pleased to have played a part in this safe and happy out of hospital delivery. It wishes the family all the best as they welcome their newest member into the world.